According to recent reports, President Trump may soon dismantle the National Endowment for the Arts. The 50-year-old federal agency offers grants for artistic productions, exhibitions, and research. Reporter Brad Racino with our media partner iNews Source looks at what this could mean for San Diego's art scene. The National Endowment for the Arts, or NEA, granted almost $400,000 to 19 local arts organizations last year. David Bennett, the general director of the San Diego Opera, was one recipient. And most recently, a $35,000 grant that supported our words and music program, which is our educational outreach program. All told, the NEA has funded around 60 local arts organizations since 1998, the oldest data available. And while large institutions like the Opera and San Diego Symphony are on the list, so too are smaller organizations. Ruben Valenzuela is the artistic director and founder of the Bach Collegium, which just received a $10,000 NEA grant last year. I'm trying my very best to not panic at this point. That is a stamp of approval that we just got. Um, it was giving us some sense of pr propulsion forward. As Valenzuela said, NEA grants do more than just provide direct funding. According to figures from an NEA spokesperson, each dollar the agency grants is typically matched by $9 in public and private money. That allows nonprofits to raise much more than they would through direct donations alone. And while the president's decision on the agency's future is still up in the air, some art leaders are being proactive. David Bennett urged art supporters to get involved. Yeah, I did see a petition online. Uh, it's actually on the White House website. So I would encourage people that are interested in it to go to the website and actually sign that petition. For CBS 8 media partner iNews Source, I'm Brad Racino. We've posted more information on the National Endowment for the Arts at CBS8.com.